Ah, the sun is out. Coming. You will recall I spoke to a visiting Davner at Virtual Vitra's uh, request. Well, he finally invited me to a feast. I made his proposal once I was too full of Hanish delights to refuse. He wishes me to train the Radiant Host and Lance work. But that is a tale for another time. What we need now is a merchant or a, tra a trawler for the ship fit for the open seas. Matsya is a fisherman by trade, yes? We should head to Akia and see if he can help us. Oh. No. The how the battle for housing begins. Ugh. I'm hungry. But I ain't got no food until we go to the store. And that's if I go. It's Yeah, my my brother decided not to come get me yesterday to go to the store. It's why I wasn't able to stream at all, because I had to play the waiting game with him. And then, um, thankfully last night, I decided to go off on him, finally. My friends, what brings you to our humble village? So you need a seaworthy vessel to keep these ruins. Considering it was your deeds which allowed us to return to fishing, I should think everyone would be glad for a chance to repay the favor. Wait here and I will have a boat stocked and ready for you in no time at all. We have company. Have you noticed our little shadow? He's been following us since we left the city. We see you there, boy. Show yourself. It is you. Do you know how far out of our way we walk so that you'd not cross paths with some wild beast I'm sorry sir but aren't you the heroes who saved Avner you are I know you are and I've gone and cheated you I work with Sanzel you see the map merchant it's my job to play the pleading or orphan and convince the crowd his words are worth the prices he has I'm ashamed of what I've done and beg for your forgiveness. If not for you, my sister and I would have... Well, we'd be... Enough. I knew your game would pray the price willingly. A fortunate purchase, as it turns out, for my friend here was seeking those very ruins. You're kind to overlook the wrong I have done. But there's more you need to know. The map is a fake. The map you bought is very real, as is the island it shows. I heard her I heard her Zazal selling the information to another customer. <clears throat> he told that man where he needed to search about the ruins, about the vault, about everything. Then the man sailed out to find his fortune, never to return. You cannot go alone to that place. You should have more friends with you. Maybe even a whole army. I do not doubt the ruins hold danger, but I assure you, between the two of us, there is little we cannot overcome. At least I cannot bear the thought of. 
We chose this path. Now you've gone and made him cry. <laughs> oh, now you've gone and made him cry. You know how I feel about this. I did not. That was not my intention. Oh, very well. Assuming we do find this treasure hoard, it may prove wise to have more hands along for the carrying. Any ideas on whom to approach? The scions have scattered far and wide since our last gathering. Hmm. Raha. Kral may have her hands full rebuilding the students, but if you reach out to Kraha, he would surely leap at the invitation. Will that set your mind easy? Yes, if that man is as strong as you, is he though strong as me? What is your name, boy? Mirad. Well, Mirad, your life is yours to live as you will. But I suggest you find a more honest trait if you truly wish to keep your sister safe. I'm not proud of what I do. But what choice do I have? We need to eat. And everyone's too busy rebuilding their own lives to bother with two grumpy orphans. What boy. I didn't take this roundabout road just to see you end up in some creature's belly. Let me walk you back to the city gates. Call me a city in <laughs> Oh. Playing babysitter again? Friends for the road. I shall leave you to recruit Graha. He'll appreciate the invitation that much more. Sure. As I recall, he's based at the Annex. Someone there ought to be able to point you in the right direction. Let us be off to Merit. Do me a favor and don't stray from the path. Oh. Everyone, almost everyone's wearing it. Like, I, I see, like, several people wearing the outfit. Oh, look who it is. Welcome back, Ronald. What might the students do for you? Ah, yes, he's in the main hall with Mistress Craft. They've been holed up in there for days, but by all means, go and give them an excuse to take a break. Send word ahead. I thought I was having visions for a moment there. How is the restoration of the students come along? Wait, what are the two are you working on? 
Raha and I have been compiling old records of the students' activities. We located several accounts in the archives of Numenon and added them to the collection we recovered from the Isle of Bao. Enable auto text for functionality. Following can be used to adjust the speed and unforced conversations. Cutscenes. And judging by the progress we've made thus far, sorting this pile will keep us occupied for days to come. But what brings you to the Annex, my friend? Surely you haven't come all this way just to watch us shuffle dusty papers around? Oh, that's pretty cool. The treasure vault of Al Zadar the Third. Mm hmm. And you're looking for companions to join you on this expedition. I would dearly love to accompany you, of course, but I'm afraid I'm committed to another task. On the subject of which, I had hoped to ask for your assistance. What is it? Aha. Uh -huh. Then again, it's not so urgent that it can't wait until you've returned. You should go, Raha. I'll stay here and mind the shop, as it were. <laughs> Are you sure? I'd hate to leave you short-handed. Right. I'm sure. Just try to be back before too many moons have passed. Well... I guess we're off on another adventure already. Made a promise. Have you asked anyone else to come along? Eh. Yeah. Then might I suggest we invite Yostola? Ever since the Scions disbanded, she spent most of her time cloistered within the Great Google Library hoping to piece together a method to traverse the rift. It would seem, however, that whatever wisdom she sought there was not to be found. She arrived in Charlia the other day. We spoke briefly before she began her search of Numenor. Considering what you've told us of al -Zadar's extraordinary feats, I do believe your Stola would be more than interested to hear ah, what you have to say. The rumor that he went... He was able to travel to another world. Splendid. <clears throat> then let us head to the archives of At least other worlds. Wait before you go. I have another potential member to volunteer, if you've room to spare. Bouillonger. He sent the students a request for materials, you see. Treatises on the architecture of treasure vaults and the like. Yeah, we can do that. From what I can gather, the Lotharits are looking to make improvements to their own creation and wish to learn more about how we build things down here. Oh boy. So, why not take Urianger with you? Let him study Alzadar's legacy firsthand. None can deny the benefit of seeing something with your own eyes. Exactly. If our expedition leader has no objections, I nope. say we extend Uriange an invitation once we've spoken with your Stola. Safe travels, you two. But don't forget, I'd still like your help with that other matter I mentioned. You will. Right. You will. Then it's off to the library.
Mm -hmm. So where is this? Oh, we gotta go all the way that way. Brow has been added to the uh, and then incorrect. Brow has been added to the on the. It makes me wonder if I have to actually play through the game again. Like, do New Game Plus in order to get more knowledge and information for the codex. I'm putting my... No, your pudding was not needed for the final days. be able to finally see this. Hey, look, it's just stone. Law. The stoler is just straight up sleeping. He just laying there dead. She dead. The stoler is dead from too much reading. He died of boredom. Stola to doze off in the middle of research before. Oh, they just literally wait for her to wake up. And a thousand lifetimes passed before. <laughs> Actually, only a few hours. I like how the music just stops. You don't want to wake you. Well, yeah, that is a thing that happens. As you know, I've been researching ways to travel from the source to one of its reflections. I just want to make sure. Okay. Well, looking for hints, at least. I don't expect to find a simple set of instructions tucked away in some dark corner of the library. So I've been skimming through the stacks, hoping to uncover even a partial mention of any similar feats in the past. The means to travel between worlds exist, and you can be sure I will find a way to employ it. So I've promised Runar, but it would seem I've set myself a nigh impossible task. Go get it. You needn't be so hard on yourself. The leap I made with the Crystal Tower was not achieved in an afternoon. It was the culmination of a collective effort spanning generations. Oh, you think me discouraged. I assure you, it is quite the opposite. A daunting challenge and the time to sink my teeth into it. I feel like a fresh-faced student again. I see. 
dollar in her end. Indeed. Was there something else you wished to ask of me? Al-Zadal is no minor figure in Harnish history, and much is known about his family. Mm. But this is the first I've heard of a descendant surviving a trip to another world. If those tales are true, then he may have left behind some clue as to how it was accomplished. <laughs> An invitation to delve into one of the world's lingering mysteries. As if I could refuse. And whence do we embark upon this expedition? Akiali, by ship. But before that, we thought to extend an invitation to Urianja as well. He was in Thalmazay, last we heard. Thalmazay. Then by all means, let us recruit him and be on our way. That moment, sorry. Wow, now I have to clean up this mess. Oh, you're at the bottom of it. Okay. Come on. It labyrinthos time. I can still use It's good to see you as well. Beginning. And this has what to do with treasure vaults, exactly? Ah, you have learned of my predicament from Mistress Cry. I know not whence they acquired such knowledge, but the Lotharics now stand convinced that adventurers delight in treasure hunts. Yes, we do. That's true. Of daring delvers to remove so earnest and innocent was 
their desire to bring joy to the world that I found myself powerless to refuse them my cooperation. But what of you, my friends? Are you what saying... Are you trying to say that they're trying to convince people to do the Excitatron? <laughs> like actual like adventurers to do the Excitatron like we do? This is indeed a most fortuitous opportunity. <laughs> because I should be to accept thine invitation. They're gonna have more people doing maps. It'd be interesting to be able to take like NPCs into doing maps. Too long. I, though I cherish the Scion's accomplishments, it is pleasant to not have the weight of the world upon our shoulders for a change. Exactly. Counting the steam, we number five now, yes? Without knowing what traps or perils await unwary feet, we may be wise to refrain from recruiting others. Yeah. I agree. Between us. We should have the skills to handle whatever situation may arise. Shall we be on our way? What, no time to spare a word for the grizzled old bard? All is well, I trust. A wasted trip, I'm afraid. I'd hoped to catch up with a former mentor while you parleyed with the rabbits, but it seems our paths were not to cross. How was your pilgrimage? Having an astrologian beside you on the road is surprisingly convenient. And it doesn't hurt that he's making strides with his life puzzle plan. In any case, as we made our way around Ilzabad, we saw that much of the continent was in various stages of chaos. A certain amount of disorder is to be expected. The final days are over, and the people no longer have a common thread binding them together. Yeah. That's the thing with these fledgling troubles, eh? We need to keep an eye out, lest they mature into full-grown headaches. So, for what reason have so many esteemed personages seemed fit to gather? Beneath the waters of the bounty, you say? I see you've already stolen away my traveling partner with the promise of unexplored ruins and scholarly glory. <laughs> Nay, it is not for mine own indulgence, but rather the fulfillment of my commitment to the Lotharids. Oh. Ah, of course. And if you have a Stinian rounding out your group, you'll likely have all the members you need. Uh oh. Left out. I could put in a good word for you if you like. We may have been released from our obligations, but I'll never be free of that merciless wit of yours, will I? <laughs> oh God. In all seriousness, it is best I sit this one out. Too many former scions consorting with one another might be seen as a cause for concern in certain quarters. I'll return to my usual reconnaissance and scout out the situation in the Far East. Feel free to share if you come across any interesting revelations. Hmm. Till we meet again. Shall we also hasten our departure? Sir Estinian will wonder what has become of us.
Yep, we got our maps for tomorrow. I send you the Greek crew Graha and you return with an entire survey team. <laughs> yep. I hope Matias Matias boat is sturdy enough to carry us all. What he means is, we are grateful for the use of one of your precious fishing vessels. We are more than glad for a chance to provide it. I only ask that you take care to steer clear of the reefs and the shallows in the shallows there. Keep an eye out. Big alien soup. Mm. Pancakes. Always pancakes. Azadale's legacy. This might be it. Azrael 3, I confess I am somewhat embarrassed that the tale of his journey to another world escaped my notice. Could it be more than triple folklore? And what of the treasure he supposedly bought back? This undersea vault may hold relics from another reflection. My friends, we should temper our expectations. The map don't promise ruins, but beyond that, we know not what we will find. Not until we find it, hey. So let's let us dispense with the con trickster and set sail for the vault. Oh, didn't see that guy. 